Stephen R. Kell, a part-time police officer in New Hampshire and father to two teenage daughters, was fatally shot Monday night. Arkell was responding to a domestic dispute call in Brentwood when he was shot. The house he was responding to then caught fire and exploded, burning all the way down to the foundation. The condo was owned by 86-year-old Walter Nolan. He lived there with his 47-year-old son, Michael. Neighbors reportedly heard the two arguing yesterday and called 911. Officials say Brentwood police officer Stephen Arkell was the first to arrive on the scene. The suspected gunman, Michael Nolan, was presumably killed in the fire or the explosion at the home. Portsmouth Herald reports neighbors said both Michael and Walter often had arguments at the $250,000 duplex. Before being evacuated, neighbor Susan Hughes said she saw Walter Nolan being taken from the scene by ambulance. At the time, his son was still believed to be inside the home, she said. New Hampshire Governor Maggie Hassan lives just a few miles from Brentwood. In speaking to the media, she focused on Officer Arkell instead of the Nolans. When an officer is killed in the line of duty, it strikes at the very fabric of our society. And I know all join with me tonight in sorrow for the loss of Officer Arkell. Residents near the explosion were evacuated, but they've since been able to return home. An investigation is still ongoing, and there's no word yet on what caused the fire or the explosion. For Newsy, I'm Cliff Judy.